And we're back. Let's talk to the last question mark over here. And look who it is. The Betrayer. Oh, I was... I'm gonna kill you, Johnny. Yo, Zach. Glad to see you one piece. You can check your pirate song by talking to Johnny. Yeah, this is... This tells you, like, how many times you've died. How many platinum tickets you've used. Oracle dolls. Um, the number of Harami Q you've earned. I don't know what the heck is... What the heck Harami stands for. I'm... I'm I know Q is probably quoting to, like, IQ... Like intelligence quotient, but I don't know what Harami Q. Maybe Harami stands for intelligence. I don't know. And this is how much money I've earned, and this is how uh, long we've been journeying. Woohoo! 45 minutes and three videos. That's because I had to upload the camera to the, you know, I mean the video to the computer between parts. So let's just get started. Oh yeah, you have to click on the big guy over here, the big boss right here. Yep. Click on him. And click on Jungle Ruins. Alright, let's go to the Pit of Tragedy! Woo! Alright, this is going to be our first real puzzle in the game. Then again, they're all, you know, puzzles. Every single level in this game, including bosses, is a puzzle. <laughs> Which makes this game pretty awesome, because every single level is impressive, because how different things, I mean, how many different things they programmed into it. Now, here's the pit of tragedy right here. Look at those spikes. See those spikes? And there appears to be a skull head attached to them. And I, I really don't want to become there. Oh, and by the way, there's a door here with a keyhole that you can't you can't do anything with that right now. So just go up the stairs, click your way up. You gotta click on spots on the ground to move your character. It's pretty easy. Ooh, shiny! Shiny key! I want the key! Give me the key! Yeah, if you try and get the key there, you'll get absolutely Absolutely nothing. So, uh, go on. Oh, wait, no, this is the wrong one, but I'll pick it up anyway. Sometimes rocks hold coins and stuff. You can use the coins to buy Oracle dolls and or pay someone Oracle dolls platinum tickets. Ah, it's a snake! Or pay, uh, uh, someone else that you'll meet later on. Oracle dolls, platinum tickets, and someone else. Hey, little, little snake. Uh, how's it going there? I'm just gonna, you know, kind of approach you nice and close and, you know, can I pet you on the head? I mean, I... You wouldn't mind if I pet you on the head, would you? I mean, you're just a little snake. I know you like to be pet just like any other animal. And ding, 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 ding! All right, we got this. We have turned the snake into the Slither Gripper. And now we click our way back over to the key. And let's... Now that we can get the key. And whoops, I... Yeah, grabby, grabby, there we go. Pull, pull, there we go. Yay! We got the key. Thank you. Thank you very much. I know that was genius of me. And grab the key. You can only carry one item at a time, so it, when you grab an item, you drop the other one. Just keep that in mind for later levels, because that is part of the puzzles. And let's gr put, the, put the key in the hole, that's what she said, and turn your wrist to open the door, and woo! And there we go, we have opened the door. But, there's a little more to this, of course, because this right here, this leads to the pit of death right there, the pit of tragedy. So let's just click on this boss right here, or vase, whatever you want to call it. <laughs> Yo, Zach, Wiki, what the heck is he doing here? What's well, shaking? The treasure lies before you, but don't let your gods down. One false move can end it all. Press the B button to look around. Think carefully about your next step, or it might be your last. I'll give you a shout out later. I'll give you a shout later. Okay, click on the vase again. Or the vase. Potato, potato, tomato, tomato. <laughs> Alright, and he just runs away like a coward. Okay, now see this chain up here? Click on the chain, and the, just like the key, you will not be able to get it. And so also, just like the key, you will need to extend your grip with the Slither Gripper. So let's go back up to the top and get the Slither Gripper. Hello, little snaky snake. How's it going? And around the bend we go, clicking our way along the floor. That's one of the only problems with this game is the clicking, um... Uh, controls with it. Sometimes you click on things that you don't want to and you end up going to places you don't want to. Okay, grab it and pull, pull, pull down! Yes! And uh, I would have got better points if I wouldn't have tried to grab that first. Which is what I wanted to explain to you is, if you know how the puzzle is done, do not make any mistakes. Do not be hesitant about anything. Just do everything in the correct order and you will get a perfect score. 
that's the point of this game. But since I'm just messing around, I don't care about perfect score. So what you should have done with this puzzle is not look at this chain first, but after you were to open the door, you would immediately go upstairs to get the slither gripper again, and then click on this to pull the chain. And now that the pit of tragedy is co uh, covered by uh, stone, we can now ding ling ling the treasure chest right wide open from it being cursed. And get our first piece of Barbaros' treasure! Woo! No! Don't let me out you! Woo! Thank you. Thank you very much. This is the Ellen bracelet. Oh, it's a lot shinier than I remember it. Hurry up and put me back together! And uh, we're gonna put this baby in place, and I believe it is his right hand. Yeah, that's his right hand. Two parts. Not bad, not bad at all. Keep up the good work. Thank you. Thank you very much. He says that absolutely every time, so I'm just gonna click through that when I get through it. I mean, get to it the next time. Oracle dolls, platinum tickets used, zero and zero. Thank you, because I know how to do these puzzles, and after watching my videos, so will you. Woo! Alright, let's just go on right to the next stage since we got plenty of time left in this part. And uh, two stages should open up if I'm not mistaken. The first one is going to be... Uh, oh yeah, there is two. Uh, what's this one over here? The Flute of the Growling Goblins and the Three Colossi. I'm going to do this one because this is going to be... It's a, This one's going to have to be split into the next part and the other one is a short stage. So I'm just going to do this one uh, or I should say part of this one in this part. Remember, your grip on the Wii Remote this key. All right, get your puzzle hats on, thinky caps, I should say. And we've got some, uh, yeah, I got some ledges up here. We've got some tribal men down there. They look kind of happy, just walking around the flaming treasure chest up there. And uh, yeah, let's start. Woo! Those dancing fellows are treasure guardians. I heard they bite the heads off of anyone that comes close to the precious chest. We better prepare our wits in case they find us. Okay, the first thing you want to do is click on this boulder. Okay, shake the Wii remote like you're going to ring a bell. Shaky, shaky, shaky. That'll help you lift the boulder. And there we go. Thank you very much. And uh, collect this treasure and uh, these coinage, if you would, if you will. And uh, yeah, mmm, coins. Oops, I did not want to grab the sleeping mushroom just yet. That's okay. I'll just drop it. Just like I was throwing away the umbrella. Now click on this thing. Alright. This gondola appeals to go to the other side. We can ride it and grab the treasure. But we better be careful. They have a clear view. If we move it, they'll know something's up. Whoa! Woo! They've started the worshipping. We should be able to... We should wait for them to bob their heads and use our chance to move across the gondola. Alright, click in it. Alright, here we go. The grip. Here's the grip. Okay, move, 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 go, go. Oh, wait, 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 stop, 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 stop. Wait for it. Whoops, whoops. I twitched. Wait a second. Go, 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 go. All right, click back in here because you can't get the treasure chest right away. Move, move, go. Uh, all right, we made it across, and I'll see you guys in the next part where we finish this puzzle, and they're gonna go get some chow right now. And look at those! Look at them go! Woo! And they are very happy. Okay, see you guys in the next part. That looks delicious. 